Welcome guys to another episode of Bear Wars. Today we are playing 4Vs in a party. I don't know how many stars these guys have, but I hope they are good. <laughs> um, and also I hope I myself am good, because I haven't played in a while. And um, it's my first game of the day. And I just realized I have to finish a really, really big school project till tomorrow. So, I should do that too. I just wanted to save the present, but... Um, I guess I have to follow this man. And by the way, this is my first time playing 4Vs and Lactus since they fixed the Lactus map, so this is looking pretty cool. I mean, I kind of miss the old one, like the old design, the generator was there and stuff. Pretty nostalgic about that one, but I mean, it's cool that they finally fixed it. He's smart. Why is he smart? No. Why would he be smart? <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> smart. <laughs> Whew. This jump is always hard. Oh, he, he lagged out, I guess. Because he actually didn't take any knockback. Or he was stuck in a block or something. Well... GG Got the bed <sighs> Shoot, I thought I could help myself, but didn't work. Help myself, dude. What am I talking about? <laughs> At least I got the bed. Great. Did we split? I hope so. Save myself, yeah. I wanted to say save myself, and I said help myself. Okay, trust me, I know the English language. Holy heck. I'm gonna half hard, half hard. And he didn't take. Mm -hmm. He didn't take fall damage, of course. I mean, he didn't take knockback, not fall damage. So, usually it wouldn't lag at 2 p.m., but right now it does lag, so that's kind of kind of strange, I don't know why. Maybe the lag hours have transformed or something, but I saw way more players on the server than usual when I joined, like over 8k, yeah, over 80k, that's really unusual for that time of the day. So, um, it has something to do with that, I'm pretty sure. Why do they have silverfish? <laughs> like yesterday, there were 120k players on the network. And not because Skyblock had like 50k players like usually. But instead because Bad Wars had 40k players and Skyblock had 40k players too. And Skyblock actually had 37k when I checked and Bad Wars had 39k. That's like, what? What happened? Was Technoblade streaming yesterday? Bad Wars or something? Did I miss something? <laughs> what happened? Cause there's actually no Bad Wars update or something like that. I No explanation to why Bad Wars is how it is right now. I don't understand what happened there. I really don't understand. Why are there so many players online? Usually Bad Wars has up to 20k if it goes really good. Anyways, GG. Hey, 2.5k wins. Look at that. 2.5k. That's looking great. Who? Ah, yes, my teammates are just AFK here and waiting for a bet to get destroyed or something. One thing that I could do while clutching is I could. I could talk about. Oh no, I'm gonna be dead here. No, I'm actually still alive. Great. I could talk about my work that I have to do for school because as I just said I just remembered that I gotta do something for school that's because we have these practical biology and practical chemistry classes where we basically do chemistry and biology 
just in a practical way. We don't talk about it too much in the theoretical way, but instead we're just... Oh my goodness, should I... Mm, but instead we're just... Oof, okay. <laughs> oh no, I'm dead here. Or not, okay. Uh, but instead... We're just doing the stuff, like making exper making experiments with bacteria and stuff like that. Um, and for these experiments we're doing, which these take like multiple hours up to like six hours to complete, we write so-called protocols. And these protocols take up to 20 hours of work. And we have to do one for every freaking experiment we do, which is once a week. So that's a massive load of work, you know? And um, before the lockdown started again, our teacher was like, okay class, um, you know, this is our last experiment before lockdown. So what we're gonna do is, you can do another protocol due to the holidays. <laughs> that's gonna be great, trust me. What the heck? What? I'm confused. I'm pretty sure he was really far away and behind glass. So did he hit me through glass from like five blocks away or something? What the heck? So yeah, basically these protocols take a lot of time and effort. And what I usually do, because I never know how to do these protocols, because I don't understand the experiments we're doing. And you really have to understand the experiments you're doing to make a protocol, you know? I mean, that makes sense. And I never understand the experiments we're doing there, so basically what my strategy is, I just go to someone in my class that understood the experiment, and I'm like, you know, I just did the protocol, but I really invested much time in that, so I really want to know if it's like, if I did everything right. So could you send me your protocol so I can like, take a look at our protocols and see if I did everything correctly? And they are like, okay, here, take my protocol, and I'm just blatantly copying everything. <laughs> so, <laughs> that's usually how that goes. And I... I've tried doing these protocols on my own for over two years, it didn't work out. I was always getting, like, almost the worst marks, and I invested tens and twenties of hours. That's probably not something that makes sense in English, but a lot of hours, and it never paid off. Just like YouTube, basically. I invested so many hours, and I only got bad marks, so I was like, okay. If I'm not smart enough to do those protocols on my own, I'm just gonna get someone that does them for me, that knows how to do those. And my school is full of smart kids, I just realized about an iron sword, I'm the greatest, uh, trust me. My school is full of smart kids, we are a really nerdy school. So basically it's not hard to find someone that understood what we did there. I'm among those few people that are not really nerdy enough for the school. So yeah, that's pretty great. Ah, that was so unnecessary. Wait, did he just place water? <laughs> okay. How about you get rid of that? That seems like a good idea. Um, so yeah, Red is rushing them too. So if they could get the bet, which that just happened. got two. I mean, now that I think about it, it's c some kind of intelligence. If you are not able to do it yourself, you just find another way to, to basically do it, more or less. So, I mean, it's not dumb. I get those grades out of my own ideas, basically. My, my idea was to steal the protocol from someone else, and that idea is giving me good, good marks, basically. That's how it works. It's not too stupid. I think what I need to get the red bat, it's not gonna be necessary because my teammates are probably able to get it before I even get there, but I'm gonna get a tier something pickaxe and um, I'm just gonna fireball jump in there. Okay, as I said, it's not necessary anymore. What? He's getting the heck out of there. Nope, you're dead. 
No escape, only death. Let's get rid of that. Hello. How about you die? What the heck? How did he do that? Just good that I can... No! <laughs> Shoot now. Uh, dude, that block clutch was so great and then I died like that because three people were just punching in on me. Oh man. That was <laughs> Holy, I did it again at the same spot. <laughs> I mean, I didn't get any finals, but was pretty, pretty funny, not gonna lie. <laughs> oh man. So yes, someone is getting the heck out of here, in other words. I hope you enjoyed this video, it was pretty funny. See you in the next video, bye! Okay, definitely be sure to subscribe using this potato and click here for my Bad Wars playlist because I usually play Bad Wars on this channel. And also click here because I think that's my most recent video. I'm, I'm never sure what this is, so just click it, you're gonna find out. But um, this is like the most important. Subscribe. <laughs> okay, anyway, see ya.